There has been one age-old question that has haunted the lives of people at icebreakers for decades. If you were stranded on a deserted island, what would you bring? No matter if it is food, bottles of water, or your favourite stuffed animal, there is no question about it that being alone on an island can be scary. Often, it is a situation where you are surrounded by an endless amount of water with no way to escape. Could there be snakes? Tribes of people who have never had contact with the modern world? Whatever it may be, it is always a mystery waiting to be explored. In fact, there are around 2,000 such islands, both explored and unexplored, around the world's oceans. One of the most famous of those islands is Oak Island, which is commonly known to have been cursed. Dare to dig deeper about the mysteries of this island? That is exactly the journey we will take you on. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we'll be taking a look at three of the most interesting discoveries surrounding the Oak Island money pit that have captivated treasure hunters for centuries. Not an island, but a sinkhole. Welcome to Oak Island. You have just arrived on a piece of privately owned land that is densely covered with trees along the south shore of Nova Scotia. As you start exploring, you might note how explorers such as yourself have been passionately investigating, hunting and excavating for treasure since the late 1700s. However, that might not be the precedent going into the future. Why so? That is because, according to a retired geologist, Stephen Aitken, Oak Island's money pit is doomed to sink in the future. After spending decades of his life in the oil business, he applied his knowledge to the land and came up with the startling conclusion. Instead of finding the treasure that people have been searching for for over 200 years, he realised that he was standing on a sinkhole. Upon venturing out to the notorious pit, he first took note of the bedrock that it was built upon. It was made of limestone and gypsum, which, under the right conditions of temperature, pressure and poor fluid composition, would be at great risk of disintegration. Could that mean that the money pit contains underwater caves which would collapse? According to Aitken, that is exactly correct. Once the rocks collapse, you are left with a bedrock cavity. In fact, the geological evidence that the scientists studied has already suggested that the cave's roof had already fallen apart. Throughout all the tunnels and pits that have formed, that also proves the existence of many other sinkholes nearby that have formed naturally over thousands to millions of years. With such stunning geological evidence, perhaps the real treasure is not the gold or the jewels that mystery hunters fantasize about, but the archaeological artifacts worth discovering. They could potentially open the doors to fascinating knowledge about the rich history that has taken place on the island whether it involves farming, logging, shipbuilding, or more. Just to be sure to grab hold of this treasure before it collapses into a sinkhole. The Spanish Coin Humans have only set foot on the island for about 200 years. There could not be any artefacts older than that, right? Well, the Spanish Coin might just prove you wrong. In 1965, a group of hopeful students from the Phillips Academy in Andover, USA, began an expedition led by a man named Peter Beamish, who was famously known to have found over 1,000 artefacts throughout his hunts in a one-year period. What they stumbled upon was a coin, but not just any other old copper penny or pence that another traveller might have dropped. They picked up an 11 Maravedi, otherwise known as a quarter reel. This special coin began production shortly after the Americas were first discovered all the way back in 1492. At the time, copper maravedis and silver reels were starting to become minted for the use of new Spanish colonies and were specially designed to indicate that they were colonial money. At around 1505, a majority of these coins were minted in Seville and shipped to the island of Hispaniola where they would then make their way to the colonies as cargo aboard the infamous Spanish treasure fleet. The specific Spanish 11 Maravedi that was found off the coast of the island was verified to have been made in 1598. However, two emerging theories have resulted about how this one coin ended up so far away from the colonies of its intended destination. For one, 
the coin might have simply fallen off the treasure fleet and swam alongside the tide to eventually wash up upon the island. Who knows if it was a sailor that casually flicked it into the ocean or if it just tumbled off of a treasure chest that was being pushed around. Another speculating theory was that the Spanish explorers became greedy and wanted to hide a portion of the treasure trove instead of handing it all over to the king. Perhaps they made a pit stop at the island and hastily buried it with the intention of digging it back up later. Did those sailors ever return? Could there still be a whole treasure trove out there that is waiting to see the light of day again? Or is the coin all that is left of the vast riches rumoured to be underground? Whatever it is, it is nothing short of a compelling mystery waiting to be explored. Is there really treasure on Oak Island? By now you are probably intrigued by the one question that every mystery fanatic is anxious to learn. Is there really any treasure on Oak Island? Many people were so fascinated by this question that they took it upon themselves to dedicate entire years to answer it. Most famously, brothers Rick and Marty Legina from Michigan were so passionate that they actually bought the rights to the island in an attempt to solve the mystery. They relied on modern technology and their American know-how to locate the treasure. Because several people had passed away before trying to achieve great wealth on the island, there was a curse that had loomed over their expedition, as well as the trips of numerous explorers across the years. They were all motivated either by the idea of getting rich or by the pure curiosity of finding out the truth themselves. What especially excited these explorers were the most popular theories and stories that emerged of what exactly could be so valuable under the island grounds. One of them was the idea that there was buried treasure that belonged to a 17th century pirate named Captain Kidd. A local legend proclaimed from the words of a dying sailor that the pirate crew had buried over two million pounds worth of treasure underground. Was it ever found? Not exactly, but clues point to the evidence that it is more than just a legend alone. In the 19th century, hunters found a stone in the money pit that had symbolic inscriptions which read, 40 feet below, two million pounds lie buried. Another story that came about was the possibility of there being Spanish naval treasure after a Spanish galleon docked at the island throughout a bout of bad weather. They buried their treasure with the intention of coming back, but never did. Could that be where the Spanish coin came from? There are far more rumoured treasures than those two stories cover alone. If you ever get a chance to visit the island, you can put a whole list of items to find on your agenda, such as Shakespeare's manuscripts, the Holy Grail, the Ark of the Covenant, a Viking ship, Marie Antoinette's jewels, British imperial treasures, and far more. Though none of these stories have ever been definitively proven, plenty of treasure hunters have found thousands of unique treasures in their own rights. They include jeweled brooches, bone fragments, some ancient manuscripts, a Roman sword, coins, crossbow bolts, a ship brace, ancient pottery, and plenty more. So really, is there treasure on Oak Island? That depends on what you define treasure as, but we will have to go with a resounding yes. For all mystery lovers, the intrigue that surrounds the Oak Island money pit is a treasure in its own right. But what do you make of Oak Island and the mystery it holds? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.